Today, Zoe and Andrea Green are serving up free cups of lemonade and accepting tips after receiving some sour news from Overton police officers on Monday morning. We just decided to have an impromptu lemonade stand, mm. and um, the girls were just going to earn money to, to pay their way instead of using his money. They right. wanted to buy the tickets themselves. Mm. So we just, uh, the night before, I posted it on my Facebook that the Green girls will have their lemonade stand. but. Um, uh, the police officer just came and talked to me on the side and said that asked if I had a permit and I said no I didn't and she I asked her do I need a permit and she informed me that we did and they did give me the proper paperwork and they were very nice about it. Um, when we first had them on our age stand, um, something happened because we were just there for an hour and uh, then the cops came and they said we needed a permit and, we, and mommy was acting dumb and <laughs> someone said she we didn't need a permit but uh, that was a, like a big lie. I think she, he knew we needed the permit and uh, he just drove off. He was the first customer and then the cops came after an hour. The Green Girls story spread like wildfire and caught the attention of worldwide media which led to a firestorm of criticism. We're giving out free lemonade. Free lemonade. If you want to donate things, you can. If you want to donate some money, you can. However, despite some negative reactions, a lot of support has been shown to the Green sisters and their family, proving some good can come out of such a messy situation. Well, when I first saw what had taken place with this, it really kind of got under my skin. I've been in law enforcement, okay, and I bought lemonade. <laughs> I, didn't, I didn't close them down. I used to stop and buy lemonade a lot when I'd see kids out working like this. There's kids trying to earn money, which is, you know, it's so much better than kids out here in the street doing something else. Now with this ordeal behind them, they can focus on their much needed vacation to Splash Kingdom. A me and Angel like the um, Lazy River. We like that one. My favorite. Yes, it's like the wettest place of them all. And it's the kingdom of splashes. Zach Lackey, TylerPaper.com.